Okay. My name is Margie Flood. I was born in 1930, so you can tell I'm an elderly lady. But going back to my childhood and early marriage, I married when I was 18, and we immediately decided we wanted children. Well, we immediately didn't have children, and then physically the doctor said I could never have any. But one of the ladies in the church took it on herself to pray for a miracle because she knew our desire to have a child. Well, would you believe, after I decided I couldn't have a child, I went to the factory and got me a good job and went to work. Well, five mornings later, five weeks later, I found out that the miracle had happened and we were going to have a child. So I, we had a, a baby girl. She weighed nine pounds. And... Uh, uh, she was healthy in every way, and I was okay after the baby was born, too. But anyway, to raise my child, we immediately, we're church members, and we immediately took her to the church and gave her back to God. And today she is uh, 68 years old, and she is uh, a, a mother of 14 or 15 children, but they, she adopted they couldn't have any children, so they adopted 13, I believe it was 13, I lost count, but I think they adopted 13, and now her and her husband are ready, to, they are retired, and of course I'm retired, and I just had my 90th birthday, and I'm enjoying coming to church at Rural Road. Everybody has been very, very nice, and has accepted me as an old lady. So I thank God for, since I was 13, I've been a Christian, and I have I have taught in different sections of the church. So I have been a mother to the to the young people. I have been a mother to the older people, and then I worked as a senior citizen helper for five or six years after retirement. And I'm thankful today that I'm handicapped, but I'm I'm still in my right mind, and I love the Lord, and I'm looking forward to. What's next? And thank you for in, in accepting me as a, a person to enjoy your church. Happy Mother's Day, Sister Margie. Thank you, Brother uh, <laughs> Panky. God bless as you, you can see, I have a, a lapse of memory every once in a while. But anyway, thank you, Brother Panky, and I appreciate the to help some mother yes. put her child first, but be sure and dedicate them to the Lord and let him take care of them. Amen. Amen.